question is, ultimately the question was that the purpose is t different from t. This, this is the question we want to address using the Euler characteristic. Is a torus different from two tori, connect some, or three tori? We know from this form that they do have different Euler characteristics. Yeah. Okay. So if we could show that the Euler characteristic depends only on, as if I have two surfaces that are the same, then they have to have the same Euler characteristic. Yeah. That would be my way to tell that these two things are different. So, so it may approve it. May approve it. May may approve it. Absolutely. May I approve it? Yes, yes, please. So I'll just say here. So if answer if uh, if the order characteristic, if chi is, you know, this is a, a big word, so an invariant, invariant of closed surfaces, then because t, so then I'll, I'll explain what that word means. Объясняет, что такое инвариант. If chi, if an elicus would bring a closed surface, then because these two are different, then t is not the same as t. So this word here means chi uh, means. So the idea of an invariant means that if if two if chi uh, sorry if if a and B are the same surfaces. The word we use in topology is homeomorphism, but it's not use it. If A and B are the same surfaces, which for us we can think of meaning they they they. По русски гомеоморфизм. There are гомеоморфны. The way we've been thinking about surfaces is in terms of gluing diagrams. So if we can build A using the same gluing diagram as we can for B, then they're the same. Then if A and B are the same surfaces, then if I compute the Euler characteristic, then the Euler characteristic has to be the same. So conversely, so in particular, If you have two surfaces A and B, if the Euler characteristic of A is not equal to the Euler characteristic of B, if the Euler characteristics are different, then what do we know about A and B? Hmm. Yeah, they can't be the same, so they're A and B then, not from you all. So this is so Euler characteristic is an example of uh, topological invariant. So, so this is how this is how we use the Euler, we can use the Euler characteristic to differentiate these two things. These two things. If they have different Euler characteristics, then they must be different. Okay, so Andre is going to take it away. Uh, well, so let's take the gluing diagram of well, uh, well, let's take a look at uh, the gluing diagrams of surfaces A and B, and uh, pick the, the one which has the less edges. Let's let's say less edges. Oh, I mean, let's draw, I don't know, let's draw it, oh. okay, I mean, let's say that here is a side and here is a side B, I'm not going to, uh, I mean, it's just a sample, so what can we do with it, uh, so that the surface doesn't change, first of all, uh, we can, uh, and how can we transform this gluing diagram into a gluing diagram with more edges, well, into a gluing diagram for B? First of all, we can, well, I mean, that we, what we can do with the gluing diagram is uh, we can add another face by splitting one face into two, like that. And then, what we'll get? Is oh, we'll get a thing like this, uh, which has uh, one more face, 
and uh, one more each. So the, uh, the new early characteristic is, and the number of vertices is the same. Uh, and so the early characteristic is the same. It doesn't change. Like with that. Andrei. То, что минимальное количество ребер или не минимальное, в данном случае не имеет никакого значения. Важно, что у вас есть преобразование диаграмм. Вот у вас была диаграмма, вы добавили ребро и добавили грань. By splitting the H A into two different edges, so that would look like this: A, B, B. The number of faces remains the same. Uh, the number of edges is increased by one. And the number of vertices is also increased by one. And so the early characteristic remains the same, doesn't change. And uh, if we increase the number of vertices, it's basically the same, the same thing as this. So the early characteristic also doesn't so change. Say it one time if you, hmm. what? Say it last sentence again. Uh, and uh, if we increase the number of vertices by one, it's the same uh, as uh, increasing is as increasing the number of edges. I mean, we just add a vertice somewhere, somewhere on some edge, oh, and it splits it into two different. And so that's the same. And the error characteristic still remains the same. It doesn't change. And uh, this means that... Uh, and this means that uh, all the operations we can do with a uh, surface don't change its early characteristic. With, with, no, the surface with the gluing diagram, uh, that ev any operation that we can do with a gluing diagram of a surface without changing the surface, don't change the early characteristic. Есть еще одно преобразование. Когда у вас рядом есть на противонаправленное. Да, 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 да. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. As, yeah. as Alexander Sitch reminded me, uh, there is one more. Um, we can do, and, yeah. and uh, it's when we have A and A facing uh, in opposite directions. Ah, not the book. Ah. Okay. So in a word, that would be like A, A, and we can. Uh, fold it inside and uh, get rid of it. And so it will transform into this thing. Uh, there will be, uh, well, the number of faces isn't affected, or uh, the number of edges is decreased by one, the number of vertices is also decreased by one and so, and so the early characteristic remains the same. And can you, sorry, can you repeat the, uh, the, uh, that case, the first, I didn't understand what was said. You mean the first case so with the yeah. face? Uh, well, I mean that we can cut a face uh, with some line. Или режем, yeah. или слева направо. Yeah. Uh, and uh, then uh, the we'll get one more edge, or the one that we cut at. And uh, uh, we'll get uh, one more vertice. Wait, yeah, one more vertice. Oh, no, 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 one, one more face, I'm sorry. The number of vertices isn't affected. We'll get one more face and one more, one more edge. And so, uh, the, 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 the total area characteristic doesn't change. Yeah, I understand.
So this must be it. And there, there are a couple uh, other trivial things you can do to a Clouin diagram. Перенумерация. Буквы А на Б. Well, but you know, changing letters doesn't affect the characteristic because the number of them remains the same. Mm -hmm. And what else? You can change letters, and what else can you do to the? Well, you, I can rotate, reverse the orientation. But uh, well, you know the the orientation. Yeah, but that, that also doesn't affect anything. The yes. number remains the same. Yes. I mean, I've only to been talking about uh, operations which change at least something. Right, that's why I see these sort of trivial changes. Yeah. Trivial means not very interesting. Okay, so now the other question is Andrew. Thank you, Andrew. So we've completed. So. Завершили доказательство теоремы классификации в умерных поверхностях без границы.